treat persistent genital arousal disorder or PGAD is by looking at uh, your pudendal nerve tract. So the pudendal nerve um, encases the like innervates the entire pelvic floor uh, to one degree or another. So it's a good place to start. It comes from S2, S3, S4 from your sacrum. So there's two nerves that come out of each side. Um, so we release the sacral mobility into nutation and counter nutation, and then we gap the sacroiliac joints. Then we proceed to release uh, your sacro tuberous ligament, and not pictured on here, but your sacrospinous ligament as well, where it kind of branches off. Then we go around, and where the pudendal nerve branches off into three different branches. So. Uh, your superior aspect to the clitoris or the pe penis, um, we release a urogenital triangle, bulbospondiosis, ischio cavernosis, urogenital diaphragm, perineal branch, so your perineum, so your superficial transverse perineal muscles, and internally your deep transverse perineal muscles. Then we go right down to the rectal branch right here release levator ani, internal and external anal sphincters, and obturator internus muscles, both externally and internally.